<clears throat> Howdy, this is Brother John coming to you from a study room in Dallas Public Library, office here in Dallas, Texas. This uh, message is about uh, the five different lenses or ways that uh, these vlogs will, that I will organize and categorize and tag these. And uh, this is based on a fundraising workshop that went to many years ago. Specifically, it was for a group, for people who are going to the mission field. And uh, two or three day intensive and big three ring rope workbook and a lot of just you know, one of those data dump kinds of things. Maybe you've been to them. We talk in 85 bazillion PowerPoint slides and, you know, 99 different, I mean, three ring notebooks, just, I mean, hundreds of pages. Kept the thing, probably still got in storage somewhere. But one page with stood out to me. It helped me enormously ever since. And, and it had four, but I've added a fifth one. I'll tell you what those are real quick, right quick. Um, the issue is that they're, and they've been helping people raise support for missionaries. These are faith-based missionaries for many, many years, so they, they knew the game. The persons that are going to send their monthly contributions see you through one of those four lenses. Uh, one is to see you as a family. Uh, oh, this person or this couple or this family is over in that remote village in Africa working with, in that orphanage. Uh, and so, therefore, it was a table. They showed, therefore, the kinds of things you talk about, the kinds of updates they want to know about, how often you communicate with them, what they want to hear about. They want to hear about your health. They want to hear about your, your dog. They want to hear about your going around and making your cultural changes and stuff like that. You know, the cultural crazy faux pas that might show up you know, in an Asian country, African country, or you traveling around and blah, blah. Uh, secondly, they, they see you as a friend. And so there's my friend uh, in my small group in my social class, got to know him and her, and they, they're going through difficulties with depression or homesickness or, uh, or fears or anxiety or, or it's more of an internal thing as opposed to an external family, more of an internal world. Uh, the third was um, minister. Um, so they see you. So you came and spoke at their church, and you taught about the book of uh, some passage in Ephesians, the armor of God, or the uh, the resurrection, maybe chapter in First uh, Corinthians 15. And they saw you as very effective and very good at teaching. And so they got sampled that. And so and so you sent them a sample of what you've been teaching. You know, your teacher teaching, your preacher preaching, your evangelist evangelizing. So you're just kind of show them a little slice of that. And so they'll send you their contributions. That's the third way. The fourth way is an investment. So they so so, so this is like people that are going uh, uh, to get Bible translation work or a medical missionary. I mean, they're they're going over there to deal with the, the children in the orphanages that got the, the the preventable diseases. By going over there to translate the Bible into those peculiar languages and in, in that remote area. Well, you don't need that Bible back. You don't, you don't, need, you don't need to see it three years later because you have the New Testament back. But, but you're investing in what they would do. Um, and all those are good. I can say, as so I see that. The fifth one that I've added, somewhat different, is um, a community leader. And I'll say much, much more about this, this later. Um, but it's it, it's something that I need. As I, as I pray, as I look, as I search, as I... We go online. I know that I need to. I need to start online communities, several of them, and become the leader. And that frightens me. I've never been a leader of anybody or anything, but it, I need to do it. I need to pioneer that and lead that. So that's the fifth one. And I'll talk more about that later. Those are five views. So that's about all I want to say about that for now. But just to let you know, I'm going to tag things. Of course. So therefore, people who want to track with me. In other words, uh, about my housing and my dental uh, and, and my health issues. Uh, that's different than my fears and my anxieties and my depression and those issues are different from my teaching and preaching is different from my other things. So I will, I will be trying to, so people, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to do um, an opt-in uh, email opt-in. So people can just pick one, two or three or four or all five or just, or not, I don't care. But you see, they're going to want those different, those different kinds of messages. So that's how I segment my list and I segment my messages.
Uh, I know you learned how to do wrap ups, and we're going to try this. Please pray for me, both now and as the Holy Spirit prompts you. I really, really need, appreciate uh, all your prayers. Amen.